I used spare parts from other projects and made many measurements to create the perfect equilateral pyramid. Great costume! All aboard the Halloween Hayride! Yay! No way! A real hayride? It was on my long list. Thanks, Grandma Llama. We know how hard you worked, and each of you gave up things from your list. So we grown-ups whipped up a few Halloween surprises as a reward. scared of spooky things, too. But my mama always reminds me that no matter how scary things can be on Halloween, they're not real. They're just pretend. Thanks, Llama Llama. That makes me feel somewhat better. Okay, I'll try. Chasing butterflies will have to wait for later. It's time to start walking to school. Already? Hi, Llama Llama. Nice snack. Thanks. I might bring it for show and tell tomorrow. I brought my show and tell thing today, and I have it right here. What is it? Something new? Actually, it's something old. Wait, is it lunch? That's mine. I got a peanut butter and pickle sandwich. Yikes. You still haven't guessed my surprise. <laughs> You'll have to wait till we get to school. Look, I have a new magnet. See, it's super powerful, but it can pick up anything made of iron or steel. Huh? have anything made of iron or steel. Oh, what luck! I do! Watch! Huh? huh? Hey, can I try? I want to see if the pull the swings are on is made of iron or steel. The answer is yes! Uh -huh. Want to see my show and tell thing? Wow! Nice necklace! Thanks! It's been in my family forever. It was my grandma's and my grandma's mother's too. One day, it may be mine. And your mom let you bring it to school? Isn't she afraid something could happen to it? <laughs> <laughs> To. I understand. I think you can go to the party after the doctor appointment. I have to practice my writing. We're doing our M's, and it's a very tricky letter. Interesting. And I have to get ready for our big field trip at school. We're going to outer space, and I have to fly the rocket. <laughs> outer space, huh? Wow. Yeah, and since my chin is absolutely, definitely okay, I do not need to go to the doctor. Ouch! 
Look, Llama, I know how you feel. When I was a little llama, I used to get so nervous about going to the doctor. I'd hide under the couch. Really? Yep, but there was nothing to worry about. Doctors are here to help us. They want us to get better. Besides, I'll be right by your side the whole time. But I still don't want to go. Llama, are you home? Hi, Llama Llama. We just came by to see how your chin is feeling. Oh, it's fine, thanks. See? I can do this. And even this. Uh-huh. Sweetie, we have an appointment soon. It'll be fine. But I don't want to go. You've got to, Llama Llama, and get out of there fast so you can come to my ice cream party. That's our plan, Gilroy. The doctor will make you feel better, and the ice cream party will probably make you feel more better. Or, Mama, we could go right to the ice cream party part. I remember how scared I was when I had to go to the eye doctor to get glasses for the first time. Really? Why? I didn't know if the doctor was going to be nice. Maybe she would put some weird drops in my eyes, or the glasses would make everything blurry. But the doctor was so nice. I think about all the cool stuff that's going to happen after the doctor's visit, like my ice cream party. Think about that instead. I'll try, you guys. But I just don't know if I can. Don't worry, Luna. We will get it back. Back to the planning area. Let's have another meeting. What if we dig a hole next to the train and tunnel over? That would take a year. Or a long time. What if we take a vacuum and... I have an idea. Maybe I can just go make a new necklace that looks just like this one. <laughs> that wouldn't work, would it? Hey! Look, everyone. I got the cover thingy off. Oh, thank you, Gilroy. That should help a lot. Yep, now I can just reach in there and get it. Wait, Nellie, what if you miss and it gets knocked all the way down the drain? Then it'll be gone forever. Don't worry, Luna. We'll come up with a plan that can't fail. <sighs> okay, okay. Luna, you know that we're your friends and that we're all here to help you figure this out. That's it! Huh? huh? What's, What's it? it? If we all team up and maybe use something each of us has together, we can get the necklace back. Like, I have a butterfly net. Could help, somehow. Well, we could probably try to reach the necklace if I could see down the drain better. Ooh, I have a good flashlight at home. And if we can get my magnet closer... I have that grabber arm toy at home. I could bring that. Great! Hey, it's show and tell day tomorrow. Let's all bring these things in and use them together. I like it. Thanks, Llama Llama. I think we need to draw a better plan. Maybe we can do it after school, at someone's house. I'll ask my mama. You're walking very slowly, dear. Let me ask you, what bad things do you think might happen when you go to the doctor? I don't know. He might not be nice or do something that hurts or say I have to come back more. I understand. But like your friends all said, the doctor is going to help you. Yeah. The doctors did help them. Llama Llama? You can do this. I'm with you. I'm a brave little llama. Vanilla ice cream, chocolate swirl ice cream. I'm a brave little llama. I'm a brave little llama. Hello there, Llama Llama and Mama Llama. Hi, Mr. Hackney. I mean, Dr. Hackney. So, how are you feeling today? Not so great. My chin kind of hurts and, well, 
I'm scared to be here. <laughs> I know how you feel. The truth is, when I was a kid, I never liked going to the doctor either. In fact, one time, I even hid behind the couch. Just like my mama did too. Just like you did this afternoon. <laughs> well, let's see what's going on with this chin of yours. Hmm. Yes. Mm hmm. You want to know what I see? A chin that's going to be a okay in a few days. I'm going to very gently put a dab of medicated cream on your chin. Sorry if that hurt a little. This cream will help you feel better and better. Also, I want you to keep your chin bandaged for a few days. That's it? No shot? No stitches? Not even a checkup? <laughs> well, I don't want to disappoint you. If you really want a checkup, why don't you do a checkup on me? Really? Sure. Here, you can use my stethoscope. Okay, your heart sounds good. Check. How about my throat and ears? <laughs> throat, ear, check. Oh, and don't forget my knee reflex. <laughs> Knees, double check. You seem very healthy to me. Oh, thanks, Llama Llama. Thanks, Dr. Hackney. I guess you doctors really are always here for me. No matter what. We doctors are on your side. We just want you and everyone to be all better. Hi. Hi. Was the doctor really scary? No, nah, he was great. I mean, doctors are here to help you, you know? That's what everybody says. But I'm still scared. You could try stuff I did. Like, try to think about a fun thing you'll be doing after you leave the doctors today. I can do that. And if you have to come back to the doctor ever, you could bring a comfy stuffed animal to keep you company. I left my silly squirrel at home today. I'll bring him next time. Henry Hedgehog? Oh, Llama, I am so proud of you. My doctor appointment went great. I did everything you all said, and it worked. Thanks for being the best friends a llama could have. Well, what are we waiting for then? Let's have ice cream! <laughs>